Hey YouTube, welcome back to our channel. Just doing a quick walk around on our Humvee. It's a 1987 M998. Just got back from the body shop. Did some nice paint work. Thank you, Peter Brain. So just to explain some of the upgrades we've done to this thing. First, we've got all the LED lights all the way around. So the marker lights, tail lights, turn signals, reverse lights, license plate light. You can see we put this huge bumper on this thing for towing. It, it's rated for far more than the, the Humvee is actually rated to tow for. So we can tow anything the Humvee will actually pull. Here, we upgraded the wheels and tires. So these are Yokohama Geolanders riding on black rhino rims. They are awesome. That is the single best upgrade we did to this thing. Next best upgrade was these doors. They're from West Kentucky Surplus. They're fiberglass. Uh, they work very, very well. We had some little difficulty getting them oriented and mounted and kind of doing some fine tuning, but the guys from West Kentucky Surplus did a great job helping us out. Again, you can see the uh, LED marker lights will come around here to the front. You can see the brush guard. If you haven't seen our channel before, you'll notice our really cool logo on the grill that was custom done for us. Thank you very much. We'll tag uh, below where you can get yours done. So just walking all the way around. Again, the gloss black looks really, really great from the body shop. Here's the inside. So we've got these nice vinyl seats that work very, very well. We're actually using a Rubbermaid just kind of tote for a center console. It works great. There is our intercom system. Cell phone gets mounted there. That's actually a backup camera, which is really nice when we have this helmet top on. You can see our gauge cluster, our 24 volt switches here, and back in the center console over here, those are our 12 volt switches. Zooming back, we've got these two headsets, which is our intercom system. Still the original steering wheel, the original uh, switches, these are for the lights. This is the start switch. We actually removed a key to start switch because they tend to be problematic. I'm just going to open up the rear of this thing. I'll show you inside the helmet top. The amount of volume in here is huge. So all was basically painted in this bed liner material, which makes it very durable, very convenient and nice. The nice part for us is it's lockable. So all four doors lock. This back locks so we can secure things when we're doing things like firearms movements. So we can use this for that side of our business as well. The, uh, the flag is kind of cool. We got that mounted up on a military antenna. We're working on a more dedicated flagpole, but for the moment, that is our 1987 M998 for Elite Tactical Academy. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and we hope to see you back soon.